Hi everybody. I hope you're all having a great day. I just wanted to quickly go through what I carry every day just because my things have changed and yeah, let's just get into it real quick. This is my Aesthetic Society canvas tote which I got from a Canadian influencer. I will tag her shop but I'm not sure she's going to restock it, I'm going to be completely honest, and um, I honestly have not found anything similar to it. I did have to pin it a little bit, but I'm going to have my coworker fix it since I do work for a manufacturer, um, but yeah, I love the tote. I It does get a little bit dirty, but I feel like that's the way that it's supposed to be. It is 100% cotton and it's it's the best i will give you guys a peek inside so as you see it has a organization section right here with a pocket where i keep my keys then it has two pockets on the sides one of them goes all the way through to per se carry a water bottle and then the other side is closed so on one side I will keep my work badge and maybe like my kids toys or something and then on the other one I usually leave empty but if I go out somewhere during the day I will bring my son's little water bottle and then inside this smaller section I have my planner which is now my A6 Hobonichi which is in a gold Jillio. This is pretty true to color. It's a little bit dark on camera, but this is my new planner, which has a which I have a flip of in my previous video. Then I have my sunglasses here, which is kept in this holder that my aunt made me. And these are my sunglasses. I actually found these at Ross and they're Quay. They are my favorite. They have lasted me a very long time. I carry my Kindle, which is in this Superior Labor pouch. You guys know what a Kindle looks like. I don't have to take that out. Then in the bigger pocket here, I do carry my standard TN. This is the brown with two superior labor brass um, charms. This is the money clip. This is the heart conch, I believe. And I don't have any customizations in this. This houses a folder and then my 2023 July to December memory keeper. I love using this as my memory keeper. This is for this week. I'll give you guys a sneak peek. It is the best. I will be using this in 2024 as well. And at the back of it, I have my reusable sticker book as well as some extra washi cards that I keep in the back. That is all that is my memory keeper. Then I have my past support journal which is another brown and is embossed with the Baumkuchen logo. I have a traveler's company charm here. I think this is like the Yosegi charm, I believe. And then it has the brass corners as rivets, I believe they're called, and stitching. So this one has this custom. I don't think I've shared it on YouTube yet. So it has brown pockets on the front and the back. You guys can see I also did the rivets and the stitching in the back and then this is the embossing from Bam Kuhan. it says imagination will take you everywhere with a world and a little paper airplane so I do use this as my common notebook as well as my journal I will not be sharing the contents of it for the most part if anything I might share 
some common pages when I get to that, but I can share my key. So this is what the first page, well, the first, the front cover, how I decorated it. And I can show you guys my key. I will probably do a post of my key as well, but this is what my key looks like. And the dots, I will link the dots. My stars are from a very, very old sticker sheet, but I think they still sell them. But I've had that probably since I was like 11 years old, no lie. So that is that. And in the folder back here, it is just a simple folder. I just have so far my... Um, pencil board that I bought off of a friend it's the I think it's 2022 I just loved the pink in it and how it had like the rose and I love watching movies with my kids listening to music and and all of that so I wanted to have that one and this insert is the short trip insert so it's very slim which is why I keep the pencil board in the back because the elastic will sometimes make my writing go a little wonky because it's in the back so yeah that is my little journal that I carry around I did add a little charm to the bookmark here I love adding charms on this this is just from like a planner charm that I took apart so that's my journal then I have my superior labor pouch that I got a while ago and it just has my you know girly stuff and then I have my wallet I'm not gonna share any of that and last but not least is my new pen pouch I ended up switching things over to this I got this for five bucks and I love it it even has like a little handle if you need a little handle but I am just stunned with what it fits and I love it and it's so squishy let me open it up on the front pocket here I have my most used fountain pens that I keep in here so this is the Sailor Fuki it has the Deatramentis dark green and I use this to do my headers in my dailies I have the Sailor Drizzle, which is 21K, which I currently have inked with the Sailor Manu Fuji, and this is for my memory keeper. Then I have my Sailor, um, I always forget this one, I think it's Snow Moon, and this has the Diatramentis Document Black, which I use for my journal. Then I have this pen. I think it's just ugly, but I honestly <laughs> really like how it writes. I use the green and the blue for my planner. And since I color code my monthlies, this is what I use. And then I'll use the pencil if I bring my finance planner to be able to write in pencil. Then in the front, I just have my brass ruler, which was from Paper and Alley. I don't think she has them anymore, but those are easy to find. Then in the back, this is the part that I am just, a, like, I'm very happy that it fits. So I really need to carry my stickers with me. I am a sticker girl. And so I have my passport reusable stickers here which just has various stickers if I want to use it in my daily or I want to add it in my journal or whatever. Um, I have them handy. I also have this Hobonichi card holder, which houses my pet tape samples. So I will chop them up in, you know, strips and slide them in here. It does hold a decent amount. And then it has two regular photo size sheets in the front and in the back so these are the full size so i really like that to be able to carry you know things that i don't want to cut up which 
makes it very useful and these are also ones that I will use to decorate my memory keeper when I don't decorate at home. Then I have a paper planning whiteout and a little glue tape that I got. I believe these are from Daiso, I don't remember. And last but not least are my mild liners. These are the colors that I use for my planner. And I just love this one because it's Sanrio and it's just so cute. And this is a click art marker. This is number 39. And these are my little scissors that I have just in case I need them. So that is everything that I carry. If you guys have any questions, let me know. I will put links to everything that I can find links to. And thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.